guys welcome back to my channel today I have a haul for you guys I am really excited because I have been out of control and been ordering all of the stickers so I'm excited to finally be getting in them in and to be able to share them with you so let's go ahead and start open these opening these up uh, these are from shops that I have either never tried before, um, that I have tried before, and they're repurchases, or, you know, just all the good stuff. Uh, so let's just start with the one on top. I was super, I want to show you guys this without giving away my information. Look how cute that little sticker is. Or not sticker, but I think it's like a stamp or something. Um, but this is from the Whimsical whimsical cat studio and oh my goodness these were so cute i've been wanting to order from her shop for a long time and then let's zoom in and then back um during the pbc pbc sale i was like okay i am already ordering a bunch of stuff i might as well just go ahead and order from her she is located in australia and if you watch my last haul this is the shop i was waiting for i think that this packaging is so super cute and i'm definitely going to be saving it I did place a quite a big order from her and I already plan to make another one. I'm just trying to be on a no spend which is not working and so you know <laughs> I might be making the order here really soon. So what you get here is you got a cute little note from her right on top and it just says thank you from ordering from her. Is this focused? Okay I hope I hope we're focused and bring it in a little, a little more <laughs> so on top like I said yeah you get this really cute note we also got this cute little packet of freebies here so um, the one right on top is just this really cute reward sticker and it's just a cat I love that the next one we get here is just a bunch of uh, different let's see like no spend oh I need that one right now that's super cute and then happy mail from the whimsical cat and then buy from her sale and then her cute little girl you also get this really pretty freebie what i love about her stickers is that um or her character a it's just so freaking adorable but b i love the hair colors i don't know why but they make me super happy but you have all these different functional items which i think will be super handy you have this really adorable bell die cut and it's on really nice thick cardstock so i like that a lot and then this is the rewards card so i'm assuming i mean not i'm assuming i know you put this you just stick this on here and it says collect stickers for reward receive one sticker um for every order with $25 and above from the Wimstool Cat, snap a photo of this card and then message us to claim reward on your next purchase. Oh, you get 25 or you get 20% off. Oh wait, free die cut, free die cut, free die cut, and then 20% off. That's cool. I like that. I love when shops do that because I am, I was a marketing major. I have a marketing degree, so I just think that's really good marketing on their part. Anyways. Uh, I actually don't know if I ever mentioned that. Uh, okay, but let's get into our uh, order. This says, thank you for your purchase. And it's just in this really cute little book. Oh, I never saw that. Look at her cute little girls. Okay. Okay, so what we have here, I, like I said, went a little crazy. So... Okay, so I got this really cute sheet of this girl eating ice cream. I don't know what she calls her character. And I don't think I have a invoice, but yeah, so I got this really cute girl eating ice cream, which I mean, I don't actually I do eat ice cream a lot. I don't know what I'm saying. I got too tired. Oh, I love that one. Film, edit, upload, love. She's so cute with her hair. Oh, this is what I'm talking about. Look at her hair. Why am I obsessed with hair? I don't know, but this is laundry and she's just got that teal hair, which I'm obsessed with. You get the birthday cake, or not the birthday cake, but birthday girl, YouTube, and I figured that you can use this one for a bunch of different things, like if you're watching YouTube, or if I, I love to put little YouTube icon stickers. Is this not focused? I swear. Okay, that hopefully is better. My eyes are like not amazing, so it's hard to see all the way up there. Okay, but I figured that... 
like I was saying, I like to put little YouTube icons every time I get um, a new subscriber because I'm lame and I just get so excited about that. So I figured that would be good for that, or these would be good for that, or if I'm binge watching, or even if I upload, they're just going to be really good for a bunch of different things. I also got Camera Girl, again, obsessed with the freaking hair, I don't know why. Uh, Traveling Girl. This was like, what was this? This was like, feeling fat or something like that. I don't want, that sounds like really bad. Or, oh my gosh, I don't know. I figured, I think it was the feeling, I don't know. But I figured this would be really good for, like, dramatic events that happen. Like, oh my gosh. And then this flying girl. Again, love that hair. So, I'm super obsessed. I already have my cart filled, and I've been filling it ever since I made this purchase. So, another shop's going to be, or another uh, haul's going to be coming from her. Just because they're so adorable. Like, look at her. Just, you're so cute. Okay, I need to stop gushing. We're not gushing. <laughs> Let's see, what's this package from? Oh, Creating Co. So I have been a little out of control with the Christmas kits. I think I have enough to last me the next three years, but um, what can you do, right? You know, they're just, they're amazing. I think all the shops are coming out with amazing stuff. So on top here, I just have my invoice and then let's pull out this. So I've never ordered from the creating, creating, is it the, from creating and co, um, but I've heard so many people rave about her paper and I've just heard a lot of great things about her shop and have never made the purchase. I don't know why. So I'm really excited to finally have an order from her. So on top we get this really nice cardstock that says, dear Santa define good. I love that. And then, oh, that's cool. You get, um, to collect, uh, owl treats. That's awesome. So here is our freebie sampler. Um, let's move this out of the way so you can see a little bit better. Um, so you just get a bunch of functional items. I'm guessing her character sticker is an owl, so I love that. Oh, there's the little treat. That's cute. Binge watch, yes. Power hour. Oh, I love that. Maybe if she has a full sheet of those, I'll have to get it. So, oh, okay, just kidding. Pages, faves. So, no, it's Brie. Okay, so I follow, started following this girl named Brie, and I don't know if she works for Creating Co. or if she's just someone in PR, but she's actually what made me make the purchase. Uh-oh, okay, hang on one second. Mom's calling. Okay, so I forget what I was saying, but let's go ahead and get into this kit. So, it is on a matte paper, I want to say. Does the invoice say? Yes, yeah, so this is on a matte paper. I couldn't tell, it's almost like, it could be premium matte, but like not the best premium matte, so. Okay, anyway, so this is just a matte paper and you have a bunch of your die, or die cuts. You have your deco up here, festive icons, um, a movie marquee, that one's super pretty, and then your date covers. The next sheet you get here is your functional sheet, I would say. So you have your heart check flags, your half boxes, cancel reschedules, not happening. I love that not happening. Your Hello Weekend banner with the red foiling on that. I love that. And I like how she put the page flags to kind of make that look more festive. That's super cute. And then you have your scallop boxes. The next sheet you get here is all of your headers and your little things, as well as down here it looks like we have um, like hydration stickers. That's super nice. And then oh, look at these beautiful full boxes. I love these. So this has all of the, um, oh my gosh, you guys, I'm having massive deja vu right now. It's freaking me out with this page specifically. Oh, freaky. Okay. Besides the point, um, so I love this red foiling on here. That's absolutely stunning. I am going to go see the Nutcracker, I think. Or not, I think. I have the tickets. I just think it's in December, and I think that this will be super perfect because of that Nutcracker, and it's not overly busy, and this is super pretty. I love this. When I saw it, I practically died because it's so gorgeous. And then again with that red foiling, I love the red. Oh, you know, 
normally I'm not drawn to red, but holy cannolis. So here we have our bottom washi, our washi, and some icons. And then our last page that we get here is our heart check boxes, and then just some dots and a sidebar sticker here. So I like her font, that's really nice. So that is what I ordered from the creating or from creating and co. Super nice, and I definitely plan to purchase from her again. I'm like obsessed with obsessed with the Christmas kits right now. Speaking of Christmas kits, I ordered this from SPC. I don't know what it is with me and hair on girls right now, but I specifically ordered this because of the gray hair on her. I'm literally insane. Not that this kit isn't gorgeous, but um, I saw the gray on the hair and I was like, ah! <laughs> I'm literally insane. So like I said, this is from SPC. This is the sweater weather mini kit. And when I saw this, I immediately had to pick it up. So we get our freebie sampler here with our munchkins on the bottom and a bunch of functional items. And then our full boxes, I love the pink hair. I'm insane. <laughs> I love the hair. Anyways, so these full boxes are absolutely gorgeous. I, I don't know why, but lately, um, I don't know, I just feel like this could be really busy, but I think done right, it's absolutely stunning. So I love how cozy and Christmassy this feels. I think that this could be really good in January. So I love that. On this page here, we get our heart check flags, um, some flags, appointment labels, weekend banners, habit trackers, or weekly trackers, and then little icons and three heart check boxes. Our headers, little things, quarter boxes, half boxes, and appointment labels. I switched those, but whatever. And then this last page that you get here is your bottom washi, washi, deco, and your habit trackers. So I got that there, and then I also picked up some extras here. Um, and in this packet, we get this thank you for your order. I like that design back there. You get this freebie with her dinos, and then some habit or appointment labels. Super nice. I picked up the extra girls because that girl with the gray hair. And I love this ombre hair. I think that's what my hair kind of looks like right now. Mm, it's more blonde. I'm, uh, I don't know. And then I picked these two sheets up just because it is a mini kit and I like to have full headers. So I don't know which one originally came. I'm assuming this one is the one that originally came or was paired with this kit because of the purples and stuff. So I picked that up, obviously, but I didn't know how I felt about the purples, so I also picked up this, and I thought that this alone would look really nice. And I think she even mentioned that in her video when she was showing us what you got in the kit because she does pull in a lot of that silver glitter, and it's in the weekend banner and stuff as well. So I'm pretty sure she does mention that in her YouTube video that you could pick these up too. So I figured, why not? It would be good to have some silver glitter in my stash anyways, and could be easily pulled in, especially throughout, um, I think January. For some reason, January seems like white Christmas or it's not even Christmas, it's literally the new year, but um, I really have no idea what I'm saying at this point. <laughs> so that's everything I ordered from SPC. The next shop I have here is from one of my faves. This is from Sweet Kawaii Design, which reminds me it's Friday and I have to order from her. She does her freebie Fridays and they're freaking phenomenal. I literally... Just, it's just such a freaking good idea. Just stop saying freaking. So my eyes, what is going on? Should I go, I'm gonna go grab my glasses. Okay, my glasses aren't even really that helping. Okay, so. Oh. Let's get everything out of this super cute packaging. So, okay, so I ordered on her freebie Friday. I think I've had this for a while. So I don't remember when. It was either last Friday or the Friday before that. But here we have her business card that you get in every order. 
you get your freebie sampler and it just kind of explains what um, pen to use because she does have a beautiful, buttery, amazing vinyl paper. Um, and then you get some really cute stickers down here. Rise and grind. I love that with the coffee beans. Me time. Adulting's hard. Yes, yes, and yes. And then this was her freebie Friday. I'm obsessed. Obsessed. So, um, and this is a good size sheet. So if you take one of her actual sheets, this is more than half. Um, so that's amazing. My mom's home. I'm going to go give her my car keys real fast. Okay. So as I was saying, this was the freebie from Freebie Friday. And it's just this little polar bear in a little red, I want to say elf's outfit. Oh my gosh. And it's like all these Christmas stuff. So I had to order this. If you guys do want it, or not order it, but I had to order because of this. Um, which isn't a problem because of course there's always stuff I want. Which I've had stuff sitting in my cart and wait, been waiting for this freebie Friday. Um... But yeah, if you guys do want this, I know she's selling it in the shop. I'm sure it's like two or three dollars, but oh, I just love it. And with Christmas coming up, you just you have you you just have to. There's no way you're not going to be able to use these. So I love that. That was the freebie Friday. And then let's go ahead and get into my order. So I just got some functional stuff this time. Um, there are a few kits that I do want, which. You will see soon, because I will get them. <laughs> but I got this really cute little Halloween die cut. What I like about her die cuts are they are on her vinyl paper, so you can stick this anywhere you want and then re-pick it up. What's funny is I actually was flipping back through my planner, and I was like, I wonder if you could still pick up Sweet Kawaii Design stickers or, like, GP Sticker Studio stickers, so I tried it out, and you still can do that. So you will definitely get a lot of use out of this if you do stick it down somewhere, because you can peel it back up. So I thought that was super adorable. And then the sheets that I got is are these penguins. I picked up, I think in my last haul, the couple penguins, which is so freaking adorable. So I had to get the single sheet, and this just has a different assortment of colors. I picked the Disneyland countdown up for my PBC order, and I'm absolutely obsessed with this pixie, so I had to pick it up again. I live right next door to California, so it isn't that hard to get over there. And then I picked up this Halloween sampler deco sheet because I just think that her kawaii stickers are so adorable and I love these cobwebs and just everything like that. So it's going to be a really nice touch to just throw it in there or just keep, you know, whatever. And then change bedding. I've become super obsessed with making sure I change my bedding consistently. So it's nice to be able to have a sticker for it. I'm like tripping out about this being in focus. I need to stop that. I even cleaned the, cleaned the, cleaned the lens when I went to go get my mom her car, my car keys. Um, because her car is in the shop. Okay, moving right along. This is from Joyful Planner. I'm so excited when I, I think I've ordered from her before. I can't quite remember. Maybe it was like way back when, when I first started planning. But I was looking at, uh, gosh, maybe back over the summer and no, it couldn't have been because this is a, I'm going to just start opening this up. This is a... Christmas kit but I saw this um and people posting this on Instagram and I was like oh I want it and I went to go get it and of course it was sold out so I'm really happy she re-released this this is a collab with Ohana story um is that what it is oh yeah Ohana story so I'm really excited to finally get my hands on this and that she did re-release it. You do have a few more days to get it. Um, I don't remember when it quite ends. I want to say Sunday and this video won't be up by Sunday. Ah, what do I do? So, um, yeah, I hope it's still up when this video is up, but, um, 
yeah I hope so so let's just go ahead and go through what's in it we have this freebie sampler here it is on a matte paper and it just has a bunch of beautiful deco I picked this up because I wanted to pick up her other prayer list but it had sold out um, so I picked this one up and this just says it's like a day one through day one to day 31 it's a 31 day challenge why was that so complicated to get out but it's just of prayer so I thought I'd pick that up you got this freebie sampler with the Ohana story character and that came with the kit um, Wow, maybe I'm having vertigo or something. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like that I can't see that far. Oh my god, that's freaking me out. Um, so it's this sampler and you have a weekend banner, the Ohana story character for all Christmas stuff and a beautiful movie marquee. Love that. And then I think if you ordered within a certain day, or she might even still be doing that. You got the glitter headers as a freebie, which I think is really nice because it is a mini kit. So just these beautiful, vibrant colors. I love that. And then the kit, like I just said, is a mini kit. So you have your gorgeous full boxes. You have some heart check flags. Nope, cancel, reschedule. And then on this second page here, you have your headers. Uh, some little things, appointment labels, half boxes, quarter boxes, and then a bunch of functional stuff. So I'm really excited to have that. Again, I have a million Christmas kits, so we'll see how this gets used and when, but I'm really excited that I got my hands on it because I just think it's so adorable. I totally just showed my address. If there's a hard cut, it's because I just showed my address. But... Um, so this is from Station Stickers, and okay, these were from the, what was this from? Some sale, some sale, some, uh, not the epic that's going on right now. This was from some sale, I can't remember, but this got to me pretty fast, actually, Joyful Planner got to me super fast because she is, I live in the same state as her, so it literally showed up a day later. I cannot believe that. Anyways, so this was from, oh, I can't remember what sale it was from, but I ordered this on a sale. Oh, look at all the freebies. So, here, let's see, does this say it? Okay, this just says, thank you for shopping this sale and supporting our small business. We hope you love it. And this is on glossy paper. And then you also got this little card that says dream big and questions, concerns. And it has all of her contact information. So the kit that I have here is a beautiful New Year's kit. And it is foiled. So I'm obsessed. And I think it only came in matte paper. Or no, I think I ordered it in matte paper. Um, so yeah. Here we have this came with it, and it's just a bunch of foiled icons. You have uh, just a bunch of functional stuff. Workout, running, heart, gym, um, camera, just all of these cleaning stuff, all of these good icons that are going to be super functional throughout. You have these beautiful foiled full boxes, and that's what really drew me in. I felt like it was a nice contrast so it wasn't super dark but it was still kind of new year's-y and when I ordered this I kind of not want to say regret it but I then realized that new year's is the same week as Christmas and I probably won't be using this unless I use this on the first week of January I don't know we'll see what happens but I really like it and if I don't use it, I can always save it for something else. But I do absolutely love all the foiling. I did get it on matte paper. I have been jumping back and forth between using matte and glossy just to test out different shops and how I like um, their papers. I do really like glossy, but some shops, their matte paper is just phenomenal, especially if it's a premium matte. So I thought I'd try out her matte. Um, so let's go ahead and go through this. So our full boxes and then up here you have a strip of washi. Our heart check boxes, again a strip of washi. 
our functional page. So we have glitter headers, half boxes, um, our appointment labels, canceled reschedules, a weekly habit, our regular headers, quarter boxes, festive icons, habit trackers, and a movie marquee, our little things, date covers, and date dots. And then on our last page here, we have our washi and our deco. So her matte paper is nice. It feels really nice. It's not a stiff matte paper. I just feel like the colors aren't that vibrant. So um, if I order from her again, I think I will order her glossy paper because her glossy paper feels really nice. And that color looks absolutely gorgeous. So if that's something that you guys not are concerned about but that you guys look for in a shop in the paper then that's just my suggestion not that it's bad in any way shape or form it's an absolutely beautiful kit but the colors aren't that vibrant so for me personally i would just veer more towards the glossy just because that's what i look for and this next shop here moving right along this is from the organizing companion and i've been following this shop for quite some time now. I really like this packaging. I don't know why. And I'm really excited to finally place an order. So it did come with this backing of a, just like a thing and then my invoice and then this kit. So when I saw this, I am, was super obsessed. Ooh. And I believe it was a pre-order. So for a pre-order, it got to me pretty fast. And I can't tell if this is a glossy or a matte. Let's see. It doesn't say. So, I think it might be, it's not, I think it's a glossy. I can't really tell. I don't think it's a matte. It's definitely not like the station stickers, but it's not like Ohana story or scribble prints. I can't tell. Anyways, so like I said, this was a pre-order. It was limited edition and it was a re-release. So this is a winter in Paris, winter in Paris from the organization. So I don't know if my camera cut off this page, but you know, we might have been going through it and then it was like, bye. So <laughs> on this page, we have some more functional items it looks like over here we have washi half boxes quarter boxes and then all these functional items this is really pretty it looks like a weekend banner but it doesn't say weekend and then we have our washi and half boxes i like how this design like the paper is super nice i like that a lot it is half polka dot half watercolor that's really beautiful just kind of like that one love that we have our full boxes and some more washi strips on top of that. I love how she really utilizes the full kit or the full, um, not kit, the full page. I read kit B there, so that's why I said kit. Anyways, I like how she also drops that, uh, the full boxes in the pattern back there. So it literally matches your full boxes. That's really nice. We have our bottom washi, scalloped washi, uh, and date covers, our headers and little things, and then our deco and sidebar. Gosh, can you tell this video, video has been long? I'm starting to word vomit everywhere. So I'm really beyond happy with this kit. I think you do get so much, and I don't know if you had the option to do a la carte or what. I'm trying to see, we have six, seven, eight pages here. Super beautiful, and I love that it was Paris because I'm now obsessed ever since visiting, but I do think that the functionality of this kit is super phenomenal. You'll be able to definitely get a few weeks out of this, and um, the paper is amazing as of what I can tell from right now. Okay, keep trucking with me. We are on to our next uh, shop and this is from paper blush bar as I mentioned before I um, have been wanting to try out different shops and their papers so I got both her glossy which I have previously gotten um, and her matte so because I got two kits so let's find out what those are 
on here. This is the freebie sampler that you get every single time. And it's just a bunch of functional items and I love it. And then I got to two kits. Oh, that's my invoice. So I am obsessed with this artwork. Last uh, October, I want to say like Sparkly Paper Co. or something. Not Sparkly Paper Co. Um, Simply Watercolor Co. Or someone came out with a beautiful limited edition and she had to re-release it like five times. And it sold out so fast every single time and I could never get my hands on it. So when I saw um, Paper Blush Bar do a kit in this, I immediately had to pick it up. I don't believe I'll be using this this uh, October Halloween season, but it's, I'm totally going to save it for next year because I, you know, I'm obsessed. So let's go ahead and get into it. You do have this really pretty silver foiling on it, um, and I'm sure you guys recognize this artwork with this beautiful girl. So stunning. So I like how this is very pastel, pink, light blues. It's just a really nice twist on Halloween kit. On this next page here, we have our half boxes, festive icons, weekend banner, flags, habit trackers, and um, icons. Why was that so difficult? <laughs> On this next page here, we have our heart check boxes and then two notes boxes, our headers, date covers, and heart check flags. And then our washi, bottom washi, some flags, and then a weekly habit. So that's on her glossy paper. I'm obsessed with it. I um, have only ordered glossy from her before, so I'm really happy that I bought it, this kit. What was I saying? I, oh gosh, brain. This haul's been too long because my brain's going insane, but yeah, it's so beautiful. So that's that kit. And then the next kit that I got here, this is the one that I got on her matte paper. It's nice. It's not horrible. It kind of feels like a premium matte, um, and I really like it. I would order it from her again. However, I think I prefer glossy just because I think I prefer glossy paper more in general, whether it's um, a vinyl. I think I go vinyl, glossy, and then matte. But sometimes it's like premium matte, you know? I think it's just finding what you absolutely love and... Um, her paper is absolutely stunning. I would actually 100% recommend it. It's nice. It's buttery. Um, the foiling looks phenomenal on this. The glossy feels amazing too. So if she was ever sold out in glossy, I would definitely get matte. Um, if she was ever sold out in matte, I'd definitely get glossy. I think they're both really nice options. Um, if you, you know, prefer one or the other. Um, but let's go ahead and get into this. When I saw this, I've been looking for a really nice Thanksgiving kit. I didn't want anything really too um, clip art y or too Thanksgiving y. Um, I absolutely love Thanksgiving. I think it's an amazing holiday to be very thankful. I love how the family comes together. Um, and yeah, I just absolutely love it. But I um, didn't want anything too, I don't know. Um, and I mean, I would say I'm a veget I am a vegetarian and I didn't want turkeys, but I think turkeys kind of go along with Thanksgiving. So it's not even that it was that I just didn't find anything that I loved. So when she released this and she posted that it would be a good Thanksgiving kit, I was like, it would absolutely be a good Thanksgiving kit. So long story short, this is what I'm going to be using for Thanksgiving. And I think it's so stunning. I love the foiling on it. It is a rose gold foiling and, um, yeah, so these are your beautiful full boxes. Again, you have that functional sheet. I love this pattern and the color is so beautiful. You can really see how gorgeous this kit is in the full box or the heart check boxes. We have our headers page and then our washi page. So I really do like her mat. Her mat is really, really nice. I 100% would recommend it. Um, and then I think what it just comes down to is do you prefer glossy or matte really with her shop. So I'm really happy that I was able to pick up both papers and be able to test those out. 
Okay, you guys, if you made it this far, I'm so, so thankful because, oh my god, this, this is a long haul. But this is our last shop for this haul. And this is from the Paper Dove Shop. This I ordered from um, the PBC sale. I need my scissors. And so this should have been in my PBC sale haul, but um, it came just, just a tad bit later than all the others. So you have this little cardstock, which I already have one of these, um, and it says thank you on the back. And then another Christmas crit, surprise, surprise. She came out with this last year and I didn't pick up, pick it up and I regretted it. So I'm happy I have it in my hands now. On this first page here, or not first page, but you get your freebie here. And it's just a bunch of functional pieces. Is this a full box? Oh yeah, that's nice. You get a nice full box there. That's really pretty. Um, and then a build do habit tracker and weekly tracker and then the kit you guys probably recognize this This is a Christmas kit. This would also be good for the nutcracker because of the nutcracker really beautiful I like how white and airy this is you get six seven eight boxes So beautiful this could even be really pretty for like the first week of January even though it's more Christmassy, but yeah, so here we have our full boxes and a weekly habit our functional page, so we have our today and to-do headers, build do's, habit trackers, heart check flags, icons, a planner, half boxes, quarter boxes, and more half boxes. And then our last page here, we have our washi, um, bottom washi, and then our date covers. So this is her mini kit, and I really do like her mini kit. I think I would even be really nice to pull in, um, you know, these headers from Scribble Prints Co. that I just showed you guys. So that would look really good um, with everything. So you guys, if you made it this far, thank you. I am really proud of you. Um, I absolutely love hauls. Sometimes when I order from um, shops, I get so overwhelmed because... I just feel like I want to buy everything and I don't really know where to start. I feel like that also happens because I've been planning for, oh gosh, I don't even know, for what, like two and a half years now. And um, I just I still feel like I get so lost when ordering from a shop. Um, like I just, you know, I don't know... I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Does that make sense? Like, I still feel like it's nice to see hauls to kind of help guide you and see what other people are getting because it really just helps steer you in the right direction. And I don't know if that even makes sense, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this haul. Maybe you guys saw some things that you guys want to pick up um, or some shops that you might be a little bit more intrigued in and want to go check out. I'm really excited to put these away and then hopefully use them very, very soon. Um, again, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you guys are having an amazing day, week, and month, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video.